Hello and welcome to Signature TV News Highlight for this Thursday. I am Oboman Marvelous Chinedu. Three police officers in Ebony State died on Wednesday in a road accident at the Isieke Junction on Abakliki Enugu Highway. The Commissioner of Police in the state, Gariba Liu, who confirmed the incident to journalists, said 10 other police officers sustained injuries in the accident. Mr. Liu said the accident occurred while the officers were returning from a peacekeeping mission after a communal crisis in Ezai Efium, Ohunku local government area of the state. A leadership tussle among members of the National Union of Road Transport Workers in the two communities degenerated into a communal crisis recently. The shown of Obomosho land, Oba or Laduni Onyewumi, has held President Muhammad Buhari for approving the establishment of Federal Polytechnic in Ayede, Obomosho. The monarch also lauded the president for approving a takeoff grant of 2 billion naira for the new institution. Oba Oyewumi, in a statement on Wednesday, called on the host community to give the institution the maximum support it required for its smooth takeoff. He also lauded Governor Sheyi Makinde, the Minister of Youth, Development and Sports, Dari Sunday, and other stakeholders. The Owurun Shoki Ban Lane of the Third Melan Bridge will be closed totally to vehicular movement by midnight on Saturday, February 6th, till 7 pm on Sunday, February 7th, to remove the last expansion joint on the Owurun Shoki Bound Lane. According to a statement released by the Ministry of Transportation on Wednesday, the closure is vital to enable the contractor move its equipment to the Woronshoki bound lane within the given period without any interruption. The Commissioner for Transportation, Dr. Frederick Oladeinde, said motorists from Ogudu, Alapere, and Bagada were advised to use Ikorodu Road, Jibo, and Yaba as alternative routes, while Iyana Worosoki bound traffic from the Legod Island, Ido, Onyibo, Adekule, and Yaba she used Herbert Macaulay Way, Jibowu and Ikorodu Road as alternative routes. The Nigerian Communications Commission on Wednesday say it was working seriously to activate emergency communication centers in states where the facilities were currently non-existent. It also stated that the state government had been calling on the commission to establish the centers in their states as this was in recognition of the significance of the facilities. NCC's Executive Vice Chairman Omar Dambata stated this while receiving two international recognitions which the Commission got from the International Public Relations Association and the African Public Relations Association. Dambata noted that with 19 ECCs already established in 18 states of the Federation and Abuja, the centers played vital roles during emergencies as they facilitated responses from emergency response agencies whenever 112 was died from any network. He outlined the response agencies to include the Nigerian Police Force, the Federal Road Safety Commission, the Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps, Fire and Ambulance Services, and the National Emergency Management Agency. The NCC boss was quoted in a statement issued in Abuja by the Commission's spokesperson Ikechuku Adinde as saying, because of the recognition of the important role the ECC is playing in states where we have activated them, many states are asking us to come and activate their ECCs. The pioneer interim national chairman of the All Progressives Congress, Chief B.C. Akande, on Wednesday described the decision of the Mai Malabuni-led National Chaotica Committee to embark on a fresh membership registration as an aberration. He also advised the committee to resist the temptation of falling for the sight tight syndrome, which he noted usually characterize most hand-picked authorities in most underdeveloped countries of the world. Akande said this while receiving an audience member of the governor Abubakar Belulet APC membership registration revalidation team at his country home in Ela Aragon in Oshun State. That's the Signature TV news highlight. For details, visit www.signaturetv.org. On behalf of my producer, Damelola Abudu, I am Obomanu Marvelous. Please don't forget to join us later this evening for Signature 30 Minutes. Thanks for watching.